Hello and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Wayne, I'm going to give you a full video walk around on our 2002 Toyota Camry Sportivo. As you can see, the car presents very well in Burgundy. It is the 2002 Sportivo, so it does get the full Sportivo body kit, including the fog lights in the bottom there. Has got the factory fitted bonnet protector. And looking at the paintwork, you'll notice it does have some very light stone chips on the front, but given the age of the car, you will find a few small marks around there. Overall, though, very impressive. Looking down the driver's side, you'll notice there's no major dents or scrapes down there. Overall, definitely a really well looked after vehicle. Got the factory 16 inch alloy wheels with very good tyre on there. No major scraping on that wheel either. Car has been fitted with tinted windows as you can see. And moving down both the doors, apart from a couple of very small chips, very clean through there as well. No 16 inch alloy on the back. Apologies for the wind today. Good tyre on that one as well. Moving around to the back again, Sportivo gets you large boot spoiler and all the black badging on the back which sets it off quite nicely against the other Camrys out there as well. Again, very light marks across the rear bar, you'd expect a couple, but nothing too dramatic on there either. Looking down the passenger side of the car, again, much the same as the driver's side, there's no real dints or damage on this side of the car either. 16 inch alloy wheel on the back, this is the one you'll find generally gets the brunt of the gutter rash but as you can see no real marks on there and another good tyre on the back as well. Rear door there, drop, drop, passenger front door, all in excellent condition, again got the black VVTI badging there, front alloy wheel again on the gutter side, no damage there with another new tyre on the front there as well. This car's also got registration through until the 10th of June. 2013 so you really don't have anything else to spend your money on the tyres are good, service isn't due yet and the paintwork is in very good condition. Moving under the bonnet of the Camry now, first thing you'll notice is that the bonnet latch is very easy to find right here in the front. It's also got one large gas strut on the left hand side making it very lightweight and easy to open and under here you'll find Toyota's famous VVTI 2.4 litre 4 cylinder engine puts out 112 kilowatts of power still running a good fuel economy of around 9.8 litres per 100 kilometres and again with reasonable service costs and good fuel economy you'll find that this is still a very economical car to own and you'll also notice that it is very very clean throughout the engine bay obviously being very well looked after by the previous owner moving into the back of the Toyota Camry now first thing you'll notice is very, very lightweight and easy to lift up boot lid. Having a look inside, you'll notice that the carpets are all in excellent condition. Very, very large boot space and probably one of the biggest openings I reckon I've seen on a family size sedan. Really easy for getting your belongings, anything you need in and out of the boot. All the carpets are out inside here, very well looked after. Hasn't had a hard life at all and it's also got a full size alloy spare wheel underneath along with the jack and tools as well. Sitting inside the Camry now, I've got the car running so that I can show you all the internal features this car has to offer. Starting off over on this driver's door panel over here, we've got full electrics to all four doors, power window lock to stop the people in the back from playing with them, central locking, and also power mirrors for the left and right mirrors out outside. Full leather wrapped steering wheel, factory cruise control on the little stalk at the bottom, with a driver's airbag in there as well. You've also got all your headlight controls, indicators and also fog light switch up on this stalk here and all your wiper controls here on the left hand side. In behind the steering wheel there you'll notice it's a really nice metallic silver dash gauges in there. Very easy to read, numbers are very large and predominant. Rev tacker on the left, speedo there on the right. The odometer showing just under 144,000 k's. Up the top of the dash there you'll see it's got your overspeed and also the time up the top there in the screen as well. Also got a very updated head unit in this Camry being the Sportivo. It is six stack in dash. You've got USB connectivity, auxiliary input, Bluetooth which should still pair up to most phones and it is also an MP3 compatible six stack CD player in there. 
All your air conditioning controls situated down through here. Really easy to use. Recirculated air, direction of air, fan speed, aircon and rear windscreen demister, and also the temperature you want the car to be set at. Huge amount of storage space down here in front of the gear stick there. You've got the factory ashtray and the cigarette lighter or power socket, which as you can see, never been used. It is a non-smoking car. Automatic transmission, really, really smooth. <clears throat> Gets that pair of the four-cylinder down nice and easy. And underneath here, you've got two very large cup holders as well. Inside the centre console, as you can see, very decent size centre console with a second power outlet down here in the front corner. Moving through to the front of the car, up on the dash you'll also see it's got the passenger airbag and also looking at the dash itself you'll see there's no major marks, no wear and tear, even on the glove box it's really really clean. Looking at the factory carpets, again been really well looked after by the previous owner of this car. Moving across to the passenger door card you'll see all the materials in good condition few small marks on the on the passenger door there but that's to be expected with the year of the car having a look at the trim as you can see front seat there all in good condition good side bolsters no tears and no major wear and tear on the side of those either moving around into the back of the car now as you can see even with me sitting in the front <coughs> still plenty of room in the back there and also all the trim through the, out the back of the car all very well kept doesn't look like that seat's really been used much at all Another way we can tell that this car has been really well looked after is that the previous owner has actually supplied us with both of the original factory central locking remotes and also both of the factory keys. All in good working order and also got the original booklet holder here with the full owner's manual and also the Toyota service booklet here as well. Pretty good service history throughout, all the way through. As you can see it's been really well looked after. A whole heap of stamps all the way through. Pretty good service history up until about 77 with a slight jump to 116 I think it is. But overall been really well serviced all the way through. And next service on the car isn't due until 150,000 Ks. Thank you very much again for your inquiry on our 2002 Toyota Camry Sportivo. I hope you found the video to be helpful and informative. Just a recap on a couple of key points there. Excellent condition for the car's age. Pretty good service history all the way through excellent tyres and overall a great car. If you do have any further questions please call us 9907 0555. Thanks for watching.